In this video, we are updating the firmware on ICOS 3 Duo. If your ICOS device sometimes starts behaving strangely, in most cases, it is a software problem. A reset or software update usually helps. The procedure is probably identical for other ICOS models. I will also put a link to an older video in the description of this video with instructions on how to clean your ICOS device. And at the end of this video, I will show you how to reset your ICOS device. So let's get started with the upgrade. We prepare the ICOS device and power adapter with a USB cable. We don't need the power adapter. And it is recommended that the ICOS is 100% charged before the update. Now open the official website of ICOS. Let's accept these cookies. Then we choose the month and year of birth. We click confirm. Now we are looking for where they hide the software upgrade options. Probably here under support. And here on the right, we have the option to update. Now we select the month and year of birth again. Let's confirm that we are not a robot. And click confirm. And here we actually see the direct link to the software update website. I will post a direct link in an article on the HEPIC website and forum. Now read this text carefully and click continue. You also have to read this text and accept the terms with agree. Now let's connect the USB cable to the ICOS device, then connect the other side of the cable to the computer. The ICOS device must be turned on. And I click continue. Then a new window appears. I click on Duo and then on Connect. Now I'm waiting for the page to connect to the device. Here it says that it has successfully connected to the device. I click Check for updates. Here it says that there is an update. And it also says that each update can last from 2 to 10 minutes and to stay connected while the updates last. Let's go. I click on Start Update to start the update procedure. Now it says to start the update, click Start Update. <laughs> A few seconds later, the Connect button will appear. And it is very important that I click Connect quickly or I will have to restart the procedure. And also, if there are more updates, I will have to repeat for each one. Okay. I click Start Update, I'll wait a bit, I click Connect, the window pops up again. Here it says Unknown Device, but that's okay, because the device has now switched into a firmware flashing mode. I select the device and click Connect. Now it is updating it. Now a red LED flashes on it. I guess that's how it should be. And here is the time remaining. It asks me to click connect again. Now I have to select do again and click connect. It literally says to wait because the site is checking something. <laughs> now it says that the ICOS 3 Duo is up to date with the latest software. Okay. Now as it is already connected, let me check once more that there is no other updates. I disconnect and reconnect the cable. I select the, I select the device and click connect. Here it is again. Now I select again and click connect. Connecting again. There is some good news. 
it says that ICOS is successfully connected. I click check for updates to check for updates again. It's up to date. I will show you how to reset the device now. I press and hold the button until the device powers off. Then I press the button again and I hold it until all the lights go out. Now I release the button and the device is reset. And that's it. If you liked this video, like it. If not, then don't. If you have any questions, ask them in the comments. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Click that bell button too to be notified when there is a new video on the channel. Hepic is also present on other social networks. Links in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Have a nice one. Until the next video.